right. And we are live in the knife round here of the second map. the knife fight here to pick sides. So the current T team is the team that won the first game, so. Trey one for one there. Total did get hurt a bit though. And Adam from behind gets two kills. It takes a long time for Rage to go down, but he does get one. It's down to a 1v3. Need is looking for the left flick, and there it is. And it looks like they will decide. To stay. They will stay on the T side. here in the pistol round. So again, whoever wins this game will determine if there'll be a third game or not. If the current, seat, or if the current terrorists win this game, then the match will be over, the tournament will be over, and they will be the victors winning their $20 Steam cards, courtesy of NVIDIA. The terrorists are pushing on the B-side. Toidal gets one kill instantly. Indy trades one on the Rage. Twiddle again gets another kill and then gets traded by Pi. CTs are trying to do a retake here. Pi is able to take one out. Both of them are coming through CT. Both of them are pretty lit. Pi takes out one and takes out another. Nice 4K for Pi there. CT's trying to push in. CT's did force up here. Did my pistols and armor. Indy gets two kills with a MAC-10 here. The Terrors have bombsite B. Be another retake here from the CTs if they're able to do it. Peeking around, gets a couple shots on the Adam with the CZ. Gets the final kill with the headshot. Drops him down on one HP. Sneed finishes him off. It's down to Gaza and me. So the CZ, he gets the quick headshot over there. Down to a two on two. Gets overwhelmed by both Bai and Bakta. Errors <laughs> seem to be on their way at the moment. Best they can to finish this one off after this game. Boost up here in middle. No information. That's because all the CTs are B side. CTs, I don't think quite know it yet. Sneed gets shot in the back from me, but it's able to turn around and take him out. Bomb is being placed at B now. Who does get a kill with the USB on the headshot? Adam is pushing out. He does get the kill. Yaza gets one. Around here, throws a flashbang, but Yaza gets the jump on him. So Yaza might be saving the gun. It is a 2v2 though. 
Rage goes for the knife but misses. Indy gets the kill. Zeros are up 3 0. CTs appear to be losing a bit of faith. Demoralizing missing knife kill. Let's put a toll on them. CTs have bought this round though, so we will see what they have in store. squeaky here. Just of the T's are a bit back at the moment. He is watching it, aiming right at his head through the door. He doesn't quite know it. Squeaky was open. This one brain comes out. He appears to be ready for it. We're setting up for the sight. Flashes are out. They come running out. Me spraying down on Indy. Gets the kill. Yazi gets the kill on the pie as well. So far they're thwarted. Me gets another one. 2v5. Counter terrorists are showing that they can still win this. Rage gets a kill in the box. That all comes down to Sneed at this point. Flashbang is out. Flashbang. Yaza pushes in. B pushes in as well. Sneed gets two of them with the AK. Still has potential in this round. So 1v2. Dinked through the truck by Rage. Need just 30 seconds here. Looks like the CTs might just play pretty defensive at this point. And who pushes out from up in Raptors and is able to get the kill on this need? CTs win their first round. have made their purchases as well. In mean, those three rounds, how they, how they did, they definitely have enough here to continue to go forward. Reach. First out is Checkers here. Tries to get the shot on the Pi, but Pi gets him through the flashbang. Pushing on the site. Indy gets a kill on the Toidal. Terrace again showing them that he's run through the CTs. It's an easy kill there. Kind of a 2v4 now. CTs are not looking to finish this one out. So they're just going to save their rifles here. Maybe try and get some exits. Yaza might have some potential here. They come. Yaza gets one. Drops two. He's them all. He dropped his gun, unfortunately, wasn't able to grab it. So, Yaza did take down two of them. Which, in a sense, does hurt the terrorist economy a little bit. The CTs are, again, a bit of a horse by here. Seven kill on the Adam. Pushing out onto A. Toidal gets one and another one with a 5 7. Tries to go for three, but Bakta gets him with the headshot. And Sneed in an interesting position here. He's got CTs all around him. Bakta is making noise on A. Bakta drops to me. Rage is peeking out middle here. Sneed gets eyes on him. 
He's telling his teammate where he's at now. Having trouble jumping up on the box. He hears Yaza running, gets him with the op. Still has 43 seconds here. He's picking up in heaven right now. CTs might just play defensive here. I think they know he's about to come. CT's here, that they're moving in. Get in advanced position. Sneed takes some shots from checkers. Gets the shot onto me. Unfortunately, can't quite turn and get the shot onto Rage. So Rage will get the second round for the CTs here. Nice win there by Rage. Really needed that if they wanted to stay in this tournament at all. Terra still able to buy though. Looks like we are going to have some action here very shortly. So that was in a good spot here, but the Terrace is running through. Team flashes from the terrorist team. And Toidal gets dropped by Indy. Rage gets one on Sneed for the CTs. He's got the op. I don't think he realizes they're all already on site. He's got the information now. High through the box, and Indy gets the kill on the game. Rage and me have trading kills left and right. And me gets the kill, and Rage gets another kill, and that clears out the Terra site. Rage will get the defuse, and CTs are bringing it three to four. Smoking off in B over there. Or the terrace now. On a buy here. Just pushing that on A side. Me is able to get one through the smoke. Dinks another one with the pistol, but can't finish off the kill. Sneed is seeing CTs through the smoke. Not getting any kills down, unfortunately. Adam gets a kill on the Yasu, who then gets killed by Toidal. And Rage gets another kill on the AD. Sneed picking up one kill and drops from Rage. And Toidal gets back to. And now it's a tie game, four to four. And there is a little bit of a delay. Twitch here. It's about two minutes, I think. So, I don't think anybody would be sniping on their phone, stream sniping on their phone, but there's R just pushing in. This B bumps in here. Pi is already out. Gets one kill on the break. Gonna drop the Toidal. Toidal's got too many targets to shoot at with that AK. Sneed gets another kill here. Bakta gets dropped by Toidal. Almost able to pull off that kill with the Tech 9. Yaza gets another one with the M4. And Yaza finishes it out with the M4. CTs have taken the lead five to four. This could be an interesting match here at this rate. Though the, I believe everybody would say this map is pretty CT sighted, so.
Just need to take a little bit of damage there from nades. Nothing too crazy. Indies already pushed into the squeaky here. But Yasa is right next to him and ready to go. Twidal got a kill on this need. Twidal's making noise in the squeaky. Got two CTs still on A site. Trying to land some shots here. Sees the op go across the door. Twidal gets a kill on the Adam. Twidal trying to spray through the metal door here. Hi. In a weird position here. Picked up by two CTs. And he's coming out to try and help him out. But Yas is able to shut him down. And me is able to op him. No deaths for the CT that round. They seem to be in their groove. And now finally able to fend off the terrorists from pushing on them. They have enough money that if they lose, they'll be able to buy out for the next round or two. So CTs are in a good position here to at least get the next couple rounds here. Rage gets one kill on the pie. Peace out gets another kill on the Indy. Spraying through the smoke, seeing what he can land. Doesn't land any, unfortunately. The terrorists are forced to rotate out here. And these pushes coming from the T side worked early on, but it seems like they're not having as much validity at this point in the game. Keep going up and they get sprayed down through smokes. Who gets a kill on the Bakta? CTs are looking strong right now. Rage gets a double kill at the end there to finish it off. Rage with a 4k overall that round. I'm looking at the scoreboard here. It's like Rage is the top fragger in the game at the moment. 11 kills, followed closely behind by Toidal. Terrace did start off strong, but unfortunately, seemed to have lost a bit of their momentum here. Spawn. Not sure what the hell that is. However, Rage is trying to land some shots with the AK. Gets nated twice. Nated a third time. Almost nated a fourth time. So a lot of nades used there over one person. They just barely got them in the middle half. Meanwhile, the A site. Oz is on site here. Interesting spot. Need spots him out. Terrace are moving out of the bomb site. Hoot's able to get one and two. He gets another kill with the up. Does a spring him down with the AK. Gets another one. And now comes down to Sneed, who seems to be running with the tech. Net. He tries to get one on the Hoot. Gets him. Another one comes in. Not able to take him out. CTs are up eight to four. here. They've lost the last six, sorry, seven rounds. Starting out five and one. Sorry, four and one. It appears I can't count right now. So hoot. The smoke out mid. Flashbang mid. It's caught in mid control here. Trying to make the jump up there. Of course it couldn't quite make it. He still boosts it up to back to spraying hoot through smoke, gets him. Pi is up by vents at the moment. No somebody's in Z here. It's completely flashed by Toidal. Adam trying to sneak over into A site. Me was watching that, he was ready for it. is making a push over towards B. Toidal. Good spot here. It's 
are pushing up highway here. Yaza spots him out. And Toidal gets a kill on the Bakta. It's down to a 3v4 in favor of the CTs. Yaza's playing it back to sight. All the TTs are on the side. Yaza's trying to defend it. Unfortunately, he does drop. Bomb has not been playing yet. Steed gets a kill onto me. Rage and Toidal are trying to come back. Bomb has been planted for the terrorist. 40 seconds to try and use it. Sneed, Rage peeks out with a headshot on the pie. That was a great play up there. Sneed gets a kill on the Toidal. Rage peeks out with the AK. Gets the kill on him as well. That was, that was a great pre-fire there from Rage. Bringing him up to the ninth round here. Rage. Pulling this one out for his team here. Up to 13 kills now. Kills are definitely spread pretty evenly around their team. Four, four MPPs for Rage. 13 kills, 5 deaths. Just the man they're going to at the end of a round. out here. Looks like the T's are looking for another B push. They're a bit smarter this time as opposed to just rushing in. This needs pushing out into checkers here. Rage is able to get one. Total drops to pie. Rage is still on site here by himself. He tries to get back to but can't quite get it. Terrorists have full sight of B at the moment. CTs are trying to wrap around here to see what they can do. Sneed is covering vents here. Luke is using the fire to push up. CTs have no, CTs have no idea he's up there close. Gets one. Goes for another. Can't quite get it. Sneed kills Yaza and Bakta finishes off me. Terrorists needed that round there to bring it to 9-5. Again, the current terrorists, if they win, they win the tournament. The counter terrorists win, we're going to a third game at Dust 2. Buyouts are being called because this is obviously the last round of the first half. Let's see what the terrorists can do here. Already getting a kill on Nabokta, who's then dropped by Adam. Toidal's watching mid here from Z. He's going to peek out here shortly. Gets the headshot on the pie. Throws a fire over by Vince. And a flashbang to follow. Arrows are still making their way out mid here. Sneed making his way over to B already. Looks like there will be an execute on the B. Just the only one on site. He's getting fired out. It's a headshot onto Indy. He's hiding on site as best as he can. He doesn't know they've already pushed up. He turns and gets the kill on the Sneed, and Toidal helps him out on killing Adam. CT's pull at 10 to 5 after being down 5 or 4 to 1. It's a good half by them there. We'll see. The CTs now are able to do the same. The T's just seem to be rushing out to A site here. Bakta already got one with the USB. The T's are pouring out of all directions. Indy. Still alive somehow, finally drops to Yaza. Adam comes around the corner and gets a double kill with the USB. It all comes down to Rage. Sitting in the back of sight. I don't know if they know he's there. They found him now. Rage with a nice shot onto Adam. Tries to peek out and get another one. Bakta is really close. Sneed gets the USB kill in the end. And that's what the counter terrorists need. They need Sneed.
already. Went to the round here. Sneed is trying his best to stay alive here. Terrace just came rushing at him out of B main. Adam's still over at A here, but Terrace did get the site. This is not what they needed at this point. So done with 3v3 now, and they have to retake this site. Back is coming out of checkers here. Yaza drops from Indy, and Adam drops Toidal. Goes down to Rage, who does drop as well. CTs did pull off the retake, bringing it to 710. They obviously don't want this to go to a third game. They want to finish this now. Strong play there with rifles and M4s. Call out from Hoot to say B again. plant both rounds so they are definitely able to buy out AKs in the third round as opposed to the fourth round here. Flash out from Pi here to get around the corner. Terrorists are playing things slowly here. They don't want to rush out to their death. I'm making his way up into A site. Bomb is still able to go either direction. Adam sees the flash, probably making calls out to his team at the moment. Smokes and flashes it out. Spring out. Adam peeks up, spraying onto Yaza. Can't quite land the kill. The nade drops him down. There's another one. Toidal on another part of the map got a kill on the Bakta. Bomb is actually being planted over at B. I was even distracted by what was going on at A. Terrace had a great distraction there. Adam. Coming out of vents here, Toidal was waiting for him after he killed Hoot. Rage gets the final kill into Indy. The Terrace. Hold their 11th win. They only need five more to send this to a third game. Let's see if the terrorists are able to do another bait and switch. He's getting boosted up here. Baka is ready for him. Gets a headshot on him. Unfortunately, Baka only has a Hamas, so it doesn't quite land the kill on him. Nade going out into Z. Nothing killing yet. Boot is lurking over at B site. Bomb is over towards A, but it looks like they're going to make another B play here. Terrorists come dropping out of vents. Rage with a quick shot on the buy. Trying to spray down Sneed. Still can't land a shot on him. Boot finally comes and helps him out. Time to a 2v5 now. Counter terrorists might just try and hang on to some of their guns here. Adam with the Mag 7. Takes out Toidal. Trying to see what he can do. Get Indy gets another kill. Indy only down to 6 HP now. He's actually going to save his pistol and armor. The terrorists are not too sure though. They're throwing flashes out. They're still playing it safe. Me has got to get out of there. He's only got 27 HP. Should be okay. He does live survives with the M4. We're calling out a pause here, so give me one moment and I'll see what the problem is. So as
as we read in chat here, it's just a tactical pause. CTs are having some time here to figure out what they need to do to pull some wins out. Terrorists only need four more round wins. Whereas the CTs need to pull out another nine wins if they want to finish this out here or if it's going to have to go to a third match. It's a long day played here. Started around 10.30 a.m. Getting 7 o'clock now. These players are tired. I'm tired. They got to keep their composure, though, if they want to finish out this tournament and win it. Pause finished real soon here. Starting to buy their guns now. Looks like they might be close to done. And there's the unpause from the CTs. Just waiting on an unpause from the T's, and we are good to go into the 20th round of 30. There it is. CTs. What an interesting buy here. Got a scout with no armor from Pi. And he's got rifle armor. Two of the CTs don't have any armor at all but pistols. Curious. Here. The T's are moving out speed. It's right next to him. It's hiding in the smoke here. One for knife kills. Can't land any of them. Oh, gets one kill on Dehoot. I apologize. It's down to a 3v2 though. Two CTs without pistols are the only ones remaining. Or, sorry, two CTs with only pistols. I apologize. Adam is already up into Raptors here. He's in a good position. T's have no idea. He spots him out and see if he can get the kill on him. And then Rage is able to take out back to 13-7. At this moment, it looks like it might go to a third round. before going down. Did a lot of damage to the T's actually, so it's a good potential here. Back to gets one with the beat Coming up, gets taken out by Toidal. Pi is trying to do his best here on Cat. Sneed comes in from Benson is able to take down Yaza. Nade brings Toidal to 1 HP. Last player with 1 HP left. Toidal takes out Sneed. Finds Indy. Lands some shots. Can't land it. Can't finish off the kill. It's throwing fire down. Bring a nade down. Then a flashbang. He's moving up on him. <laughs> oh, Toidal almost snuck up there on Indy. But Indy did finish him off there to bring counter terrorists to their eighth round. Now they need to move now. Can't give up any more rounds to the terrorists. Terrorists kind of low on money actually, so if they end up losing this round, it could be a problem here. Toidal with a quick kill onto, or sorry, Toidal died to Pi, and then me was able to get the kill onto Pi himself. Lurking over towards the B site. Just need watching a main here. The rest of the CTs. Rotating out. Looks like they're going back actually. Indy 
almost rotated out of A here, but the bomb is still in the middle. I actually head towards B, but their best bet at the moment is to just hold it as evenly as they can here. Bomb is actually making its way over towards B. And he tries to get a shot on it, and he can't quite land it, and he's flashing himself out. Escapes and gets out of sight. Sneed gets the kill on the Yaza. And over at B side, Hoot gets the kill. And the Adam, but back to gets the kill on the Rage. And it's a 2v1 now. Back to gets the kill on the Hoot. He's definitely needed that round. Good win by them. Nine rounds to 13. Tossing guns around. The terrorists are on the save this round. They are all walking towards B site. Got him. That's good potential here. He's got a mag 7. Finds the kill on the hoot. And bomb has been spotted already. Adam not able to get any more kills besides the first. Terrorists are moving in here. The CTs are starting to mow them down. Sneed coming up from behind gets one. Toidle's a remaining player here and drops the Sneed as well. It's 10 to 13 now. Sneed got three kills that round. The Terrorists flying out here. They feel like they need to make a move now. They want to go to a third. CTs are doing their best to hold with what they have. They all have rifles and one op. Smoke. And Z here. Total's going to pick out fine pie. Pie doesn't land the shot. Pie is unsure if somebody made it already over to Benz. Making him a bit nervous that the T's have gotten a bit of mid control here. Pies from all the way back into A. Three people here A site and CTs. T's are B site. That mid control really scares them out and pushes them that way. Rage gets a kill on the Adam. They're moving on to the B bomb site. Unfortunately, back I cannot hold any of them. They think one's in the smoke here. Search for it, but won't find anything. Sneed is dropping out of ends here. See. They're all lining up for him. He gets two of them with the M4. Bring him to a three on three. One still in checker. Sneed's able to get him as well. A 3k. Pi gets a kill. Only one left remaining on the T side. Rage drops him. It's a 1v1 situation. It's a tough place for an op. Doesn't land the no scope. Switches to the pistols. Caught around the corner. Trying to get the kill on him. And Pi does finish the round here. And has a kit for the defuse, bringing it to 13-11. Well played for the CTs on that retake there. Sneed able to take out two players on site and another in checkers. Coming back from that 3v5. Retares on another save round here. They're starting to get nervous this round. Had a good lead going. Counter Terrace have won the last four rounds. Terrace is pushing out. They say Indy knows they're here. Sneed gets one already and another one. Indy drops one. Sneed gets two. And nobody's even looking at Sneed at the moment. And Sneed drops down finally to the total. Yas is already around a truck. There's one on sight. Comes around to get Pi. Pi swings around and gets the USB kill. Toidle's the remaining T player. Got 55 health, bomb is down, drops down to 30 from that nade, 7 from the nade. Adam's coming around, he takes out one. He's able to hurt the economy a bit there at that save, but brings it to 13, 12 CTs. One round at a time for them. That $20 gift card to each of them. It's looking pretty good at this point. Able to have the momentum, they're just going to keep it rolling. Doing what they're doing. have done their buy round here. Let's see what they decide to do with it. 
everything they need, ops, AKs. Some shots over at B. Unfortunately, they're missing. Actually, no, it wasn't because Adam got legged down to 20. I'm still sitting mid area. This game is getting pretty intense indeed. 13 to 7 lead. Who does get a kill on the box? This is looking good for him already. It's a 4v5 at the moment. Adam's in an interesting spot here. He tries to spray on the Toidle, but Toidle turns and gets him. They have control of B site. Yet another 3v5 situation. 2v5 situation now. Pi drops down. This might be the 14th round here for the terrorists. Sneed in an interesting spot here. Trying to peek it out. Doesn't see anybody. Goes to Rage. And that is it. The 14th round for the Terrace. Now that they have the momentum. The CTs don't have any money. This is a problem for them. They have to buy what they can if they want to win this. Or they can play for the tie. But it looks like they are trying to play for the win. It's going to be a tough round for them to win, but if they lose, they'll have to force again with whatever they can. No, if the force pistols in this round is the best thing to do. It'd be proven wrong. You have to show me. Show me what you guys can do. I hear squeaky doors open. Yazza takes a quick peek there. Flash bangs are out. Smokes are out onto A site. Terrors come piling out. I drops instantly here. Bakta gets a kill. Sneeds is dropped as well. The T's have, cons have control of the site. CTs are moving up here. Yazza's gets surrounded, gets dropped by two CTs. It's now a 3v3. Still anyone's round here. Uh, no kits on the CT. They need to move quickly if they want to win this round. They know at least one is back in the quad. They need to move. Too long. Who gets a kill? Rage gets a kill. Bakta gets one. He needs to come and get both of these kills here. He doesn't have time. He's got a doesn't have a kit. And Rage takes out Bakta, making it 15 to 12. So at this point, the CTs can only hope for a tie to take it into overtime. It's looking like it might go to a third game here on Dust 2. It's a well-executed push there from the Terrace to get onto site. Do what they can. And Adam has picked up my favorite gun. Let's see if he can do anything with it. Pushes through the smoke. Can't land the shot on him, unfortunately. Oh, Sneed gets a kill on the Rage, though. That's what the CTs need. They just need to win the little fights. Oh, still up at A. There's three terrorists over by B. Toidle gets a kill on the Bakta. Hoot gets a kill on the Bakta. Bomb is coming around to B site. Adam with the revolver. As as possible, but Yaza comes around the side and takes him out. It's a 2v4. So it's looking like it might go to a fourth or a third game here. Toidal gets the kill on the, on the Sneed. It all comes down to Indy. 1v3. Bomb is not down yet. Hop shots are being missed. And that's the end of the second game here. We are going to a third game on Dust 2. Score is 16 to 12.